Hi folks, it's Jim Davis. Today I want to talk about buying a house with a pool and why it's so important to get that pool inspected prior to going to close. Today we'll be looking at one of the most expensive repairs that you can make to an existing pool and that's resurfacing of that pool and a lot of people if you don't if you've never owned a pool you don't realize that the surface of that pool actually wears out about every 10 years you're going to need to get it resurfaced so if you're buying a, an older pool that's installed in a house you're going to want to make sure they have that surface looked at and an estimate about the cost involved in resurfacing that pool before you go to close. The surface of this pool has worn away in several areas. You can see that the gunite that's below the, the surface is actually starting to show through in several areas. And this pool is quite frankly past due for a refinish. So the first thing that takes place is we have to strip out the old tile and remove the old finish. New tile has to be put on. It has to be laid out. It has to be laid out straight. Here we see the walls of the pool where the surface has been removed and it's ready to receive the new top coat. Now whenever you resurface a pool you'll have a selection of surface colors and material to select from and uh, once you've picked one of those then they will come out they will mix the color on site and then they'll start forming it onto the side of the gunite walls and work their way through all the way around they'll start with the sides first they'll start to finish it and they'll keep working and working you see just how thick that finish is that they're putting on here the surface has been applied and completed and they're just prior to filling the pool with water. So here's what the finished project looks like. Quite an improvement over the, over the old surface that had worn through. You can see the color of the water is not necessarily the color of the surface that was laid down underneath. This particular surface also has that look of a natural river bottom. So the before and after photos give you kind of an idea of the drastic change we've made here. And the big question is, well, what did this cost? Well, almost $8,000, and that did not include the additional cost for extra lights, replacement of lights, and some plumbing work that was done around the pool itself. So this pool, pool remodel ended up costing around $10,000, which is the reason I put this video together so that you can be aware of the cost to purchasing a home that has a pool that may need some work like this done. So the bottom line is get the pool inspected, get the cost for making the repairs, and negotiate those repairs before you go to closing.